toddler missing for two days, man opens door realizes this dog had her. Dogs are known to be man's best friend because of their boundless loyalty and willingness to protect their masters. We hear numerous stories of pooches that give their lives to save their owner without a second thought. Why are dogs so fiercely protective of their masters, and why do they display such loyalty? A dog will consider you as part of his family as much as you consider him to be part of yours. They grow up knowing and get used to having you around. Dogs do not take too kindly to those who seemingly pose a threat to their family for this reason. Protectiveness comes from a dog's wolf ancestors and centuries of breeding, which means that dogs instinctively know when a human child is in need of care. They searched endlessly for the missing girl, then Penny, which the family Pipple had made. After Charlie changed two years and her dog Penny disappeared for almost two days, those who saw it feared the worst. Presumably out in the open and with only one canine for company, things could look bleak for the little one. But then a man noticed something in the front yard of his house and did not hesitate to call the police. Charlie hails from the city of Beechwood Village in Kentucky, United States. She lives there with her grandparents, who incidentally have custody of the minor. However, in June 2018, the child disappeared from her home. Turns out that Charlie had fallen asleep when her grandfather left for work early one morning. But a few hours later, her grandmother woke up from her and found her missing. It was then that the woman saw that the front door of her house was open. Charlie's disappearance sparked a large-scale police search that was assisted by elderly volunteers. The search party focused their efforts in a forest near the girl's home. Charlie was not in sight. Soon night would come and there was no sign of her or her dog. 24 hours after the disappearance, police investigations took a worrying turn when four sniffer dogs involved in the search appeared to show interest in something. The dogs were sniffing around a pool on the family property, but the search was ultimately left blank. As a result, police and volunteers continued to search for Charlie. Almost 32 hours after the search, Eric Butler, the chief of the local fire department, wanted to visit Charlie's grandparents at her home. That was when the investigation made a breakthrough. As Butler made his way home, he saw a dog walking around. It was actually part of the Campbell family, named Penny. At the time, it was believed that the animal could have been with Charlie. So the fire marshal decided to investigate. Given Penny's sudden appearance, Valerie hoped Charlie was close to her too. He then called the county sheriff, who had good news. The girl was fine and unhealthy. Charlie had been found just 500 meters from her grandparents' house in a neighbor's yard. Apparently, the miner had entered the forest that was attached to the house where she lived. Before reaching her neighbor's yard, little Charlie was found wearing the same clothes she had on when she was disappeared. However, she was no longer wearing her diaper. In addition, the miner was scratched, dirty, and covered in tick bites. She was also very dehydrated. The neighbor stated that she drank a bottle and a half of water quickly when he offered her that. The man also touched Charlie. She was somehow quiet. In June 2018, she told local media after drinking the water, she handed me the bottle. I told her, are you Charlie? She did not answer me. She didn't say anything. All she did was say the word puppy. After to meet her pit bull Penny. After what happened, some people believe that Penny had stayed by Charlie's side during the time she had disappeared. Some even thought that the dog might have saved her life in the woods. In fact, grandmother believes that Penny was by her granddaughter's side to take care of her and only separated from her when she knew that she was safe. Meanwhile, the town sheriff was amazed that Charlie could have survived nearly two days in the woods. He said in an interview, it was very hot in the day and very cold at night. Also, there are coyotes in the hills. There are snakes, copperheads, and rattlesnakes. Also ticks. There's a lot of danger and somehow it came out safe and sound. The sheriff was particularly confused as to how the volunteers were unable to see Charlie and Penny despite searching the woods more than six times. The pit bull was big and the girl next to her wouldn't be hard to see, he said. The sheriff also fixed. It may be possible that she got tired, laid down, and went to sleep for several hours behind some tree or, who knows, a big rock. It's possible to overlook it. More so if the dog, too, he slept with her. Meanwhile, the police questioned members of Charlie's family in an attempt to clarify the circumstances surrounding his disappearance. According to some reports, the police doubted that Charlie was in the forest the entire time she was missing. The sheriff suggested that she might have been at someone's home. As a result, Charlie underwent forensic tests to determine if she had eaten anything of it during her disappearance, and she also suffered some form of abuse. But it was not like that. In addition to the sheriff, he believed that the minor's disappearance could have something big to do with an alleged custody disagreement between his grandmother and her mother. Despite these accusations, Charlie's great-grandmother Lisa Chester said in an interview that the girl likely left alone. She just learned how to lock the bolt. Chester explained in a June 2018 interview, 
In the days after Charlie's disappearance, her Campbell grandmother was accused of endangering the child's well-being after she allegedly admitted having used methamphetamine while caring for his granddaughter. However, the case against the woman was later archived. Without a doubt, that story does not serve to take more care of the little ones. Fortunately, Charlie was alive. I really believe that Penny was by her side to keep her safe. Dogs are really amazing animals, even pipples. Do not you believe it? I hope this video served you well. If so, feel free to give us a thumbs up, comment, and share.